had four problems in the church of uh, 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 in the uh, Colossian church. You had you had philosophy, you had legalism, you had um, you had mysticism, and you had asceticism, and that was into the church. And so we're going to look at these problems that they had inside this church. Let's look at philosophy, human reasoning. Human reasoning. Now we have a lot of that today. People who read the scriptures and interpret them as their self, uh, for, uh, you know, as they want to interpret it, putting their human uh, reasoning in there. Now I've taught this before. You have what you call uh, exegesis. Exegesis is what we pull out of scripture. Eisegesis is what we put into scripture. And then hermeneutics is the science of properly interpreting scripture in the, in the sense that uh, uh, taking the scripture for actually what it says based off of the, the context and the people that it's written to and what is actually going on in the text, not uh, eisegene or exegene, it, it, proper hermeneutics of scripture, it's just taking the scripture for what it says. And so uh, people who are philosophers they would read a scripture and add into scripture what they want or what they think is to be. It's like, let me give you an example of somebody who, uh, let's, let's say you're reading Isaiah, Isaiah 40. And it says, they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up on wings like eagles. They shall run and not get weary. They shall walk and not faint. Right? Now, let's say you're looking at that scripture and you see the word eagle there. And then you say that this is eisegesis. You put in there. See that eagle? That eagle is America. You see that eagle there? That, see, see I knew, we, were, we, we were in the scriptures back then. Right? And, and it has nothing to do with that. America wasn't even a nation back then. But people who eisegesis scripture, and this is what philosophers did. This is what Greek philosophers did. They would try to take and add into scripture things that was not there. That's eisegesis. And then exegesis is the same way. Exegesis is taking out of scripture and not interpreting the scripture, but actually what is written there. And so we're going to look at, let's look at, we're going to look at the second chapter of Colossians. Because the second chapter of Colossians deal with all of these issues. That, that, that the church back then had and the church today has. This is why we have so many different denominations. This is why we have so many different teachings about Jesus.